Joined here by Austin Lavelle, Milo Libby, a 1-0 win for Point Loma men's soccer over number 10 Cal Poly Pomona. Austin, the goal scorer, the game winner in the 65th minute. Talk us through that one. Um, not a lot to say here other than it's a, it's a team game. I want to thank my team. Uh, none of that could have been done without my teammates. Uh, starting with Eli Langford, uh, I just want to give him a shout out. He was the one that motivated me, pushed me to get to my spot in the box. Uh, and then a huge shout out to uh, Emmett for getting the, beating this guy, getting that ball across the face of the goal. And the rest is history. I got lucky, got my spot, and you know got the goal. And that was all we needed for the game. So I'm thankful to have these guys in the back that are holding it down, keeping the clean sheets for us. Because uh, without those guys, you know we can't win games. Um, so I'm, I'm grateful for our team and everyone grinded, everyone went through injuries and cramps and we were able to get the job done. So it's a team sport and I want to give credit where credit's due. Absolutely. And that one goal was enough to get the three points because Milo, you guys kept the shutout defensively. Uh, talk about your team's defensive performance out there. I mean, it was a team effort between, you know, Ryan, Sean, Matt put in a shift, Lele, and obviously Milan in front of us at the six. You know, Thursday's game, we conceded three. Obviously, we're not happy about that. We showed what we could do going forward. We know that our forwards are going to get goals. So as long as we take care of things in the back, I think we'll have a great season. Yeah, you mentioned that Thursday result. I mean, it was a thrilling 3-3 draw back and forth with a very good Cal State San Bernardino side. Was there anything you guys did to adjust from that performance? I mean, you really locked it down here today. Yeah, I think we learned from our lessons, number one. And I think we just brought a new energy. You know, first game, maybe had to get, you know, some mistakes out of the way let's say but this game we were solid as ever and I think like I said if we could defend like that all season I think we'll be a very successful team. Well Austin just talk about the magnitude of this win uh, Point Loma's last victory against Cal Poly Pomona was in 2002 so it's been uh, 22 years um, you know the last eight times they, they were 6-0-2 against you guys uh, what, what does this say about your team to be able to get this result today? I think that just goes to show the growth in the program over the time that I've been here. Uh, it's been a grind all the all six years that I've been here. We've been grinding from the start, um, and just to get this result shows you know the tremendous growth that we put into this team and where we are at this point. You know, we said it before the game that if we want to make a name for ourselves, these are the, these are the games to do it. Um, and we came out here, we came with a proof, a point to prove, and we came out here and did that. So um, they're a great school, they're a great team, um, they're a powerhouse in the past. So. This is a big step for us in the future, and this kind of gives us an idea of where we fit in this uh, in this region. And I, I got to shout out Ray. I yeah, forgot him yeah. when I was naming, you know, the back line. He was huge today. He came up big right when we needed him at the very end. One save in the beginning of the game, too. We went to one, we went to one this game without Ray back there. 100%. Oh, gentlemen, well-deserved victory today. Three points, 1-0 win over Cal Poly Pomona. Congratulations. Enjoy this one. Thank you.